this is part two of 3D printing, and I can't wait to talk about this because we are going right in to tiny homes built better than anything and saving the planet. You ready? Can we 3D print a tiny home? Yes. And uh, basically, we're, we're uh, working on uh, multiple different avenues on how to print them. Uh, the sizes on how to print them, uh, what applications we're going to use to, depending on where it's going. So when I look at the tiny home communities for the homeless is where we kind of started looking at because when I printed the camper, a lot of people would call it a tiny home because my camper trailer is also removable from the chassis. We can make tiny homes regenerated. Yeah, so we can build a uh, uh, skeleton. So kind of how I did the camper. I, I, if I didn't buy the recycled plastic, I could have just take a whole bunch of pop bottles, shredded them up, put them in my extruder, and printed directly with them without worrying about water, cleaning them, and doing all that stuff. Because the other thing is, is I encapsulized it after. So once I printed the entire shell and the seats and the closet walls and the kitchen walls, all that stuff was all built as one. And we live streamed it on YouTube for nine and a half days showing the whole thing being printed.